This is Ginger's litter of seven English Cocker Spaniel puppies. We are definitely English Cocker Spaniel puppies. We got lots of energy and we want lots of loving. Don't we? Yes, we do. Okay, okay. Since you volunteered, you're first. This is our red and white female. Little black nose. Little white on her forehead. Thin stripe down between her eyes. She's got white on her chin. Down her chest. And she has white. Mm, on three paws. Maybe she's got a few white hairs on that fourth front paw. <laughs> Do you? Do you have any white hairs on that paw? I know. I know. Okay. I know you volunteered next. This is our beautiful tricolor male. You see, as we talked, he was around, so he's got all this color coming in on him. He is going to be gorgeous. Aren't you, baby? Yes, you are. Gorgeous. Okay. We've got our red and white female. Actually, I guess I should call you white and red since you're mostly white, shouldn't I? She's got a little dark nose. Red around both eyes. Red spots on her head. She's got a little red right here near her tail. Yet. She's mostly going to be white. She said I was chilling in the water bowl when we got up here. Come here, buddy. Let's do you so we don't forget. And this is our white and red male. He's got a few more little spots. A little, a little more red ticking on him. Red spot on his forehead. I mean, top of his head. You got a little wisdom knot there. I can feel, but you probably can't see. He's got this pretty faded pattern on his ear. He's got some ticking down his back. A little bit right there on his tail. Some on each leg. Mm, he might be a bit more round. You may actually pick up some more red as you get older. Sweetheart. Okay. Then we've got... This is our black or blue roan, however you're used to hearing it, male, and he <laughs> is very unique right now. Of course, he's going to have more color keep coming in, so he's going to change. He's going to be gorgeous as well. See, he's got a solid spot back here next to his tail. All of his legs are ticked. All of his belly. Pretty baby. We have another black or blue roan. And he's got some solid patches around both eyes and down both ears. Spot on his head. A couple solid spots on his back. One near his tail. But you can see all of his roaning spots. All of his ticking. Beautiful baby. Yes. Beautiful baby. And last but not least, we got our liver and white male who's just chilling. I'm sorry, did I interrupt your nap? I saw that. Mm -hmm. I did. I did. I'm so sorry I interrupted your nap. Yeah. So he's got a white stripe top of his head, then continues in a thin stripe down between his eyes to his nose. He's got white on his chin, all the way down his neck and his chest. And he has white on all four paws. Don't you, baby? Look. See? Yeah. Gorgeous, baby. You know, we've got like five white hairs back here on the back of our head and the back of our neck, but that's probably going to go away as you get older, isn't it? Isn't it? Are you fussing at me because somebody's going to take your nap spot? I'm sorry. Sorry, somebody go take your nap spot. Uh, are we? Whoop, got snagged. Yeah. I know. It's mid-afternoon and I'm interrupted. 
to dog day nap, afternoon nap, aren't I? I'm sorry about that, guys. Yes, I am. I'm sorry about that. I'm a little late today. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm a little late today. <laughs> the little girl here loves her some belly rubbings if everybody stay off her head. Don't you? <laughs> I know. You got that energy like your mama. Hey, I like that strap. Let's leave it there. Yeah. Let's leave it there. No, you don't need a hair tie. Whoa, you boys are just down for a nap, aren't you? No matter if I'm here or not. All right, guys. You did good. I'm sorry I interrupted. 